Hey y'all, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can fix crashing and launching issues in this game. It's very annoying and I'm going to show you what worked for me. Hope it's going to work for you as well. Make sure you watch this video till the very end. If you don't try all the methods in this video, maybe there's a chance one of this method, one of the method will work. So make sure you try all the methods and now let's jump right into the video. So the first method, what we have to do is to go to performance adjust the appearance and performance of windows this what this will do will just uh, remove some of the appearance uh, aspects of the windows like animate colors you see elements here animate animations in the taskbar but will increase fps and will just diminish the chance that will in the your game will crash so make sure you click on adjust best performance and then here show timeless instead of icons and also enable smooth edges of screen fonts now let's go to advanced click on change and here in custom size make sure you 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 make this calculation 1024 by uh, 60 so or 60 or eight or four depends how much ram you have if you have 60 you can write 60 and just make sure you make this calculation uh, multiply by 60 so and see the results and write the results here and click on set and okay now the next uh, the next the next step is we have to ensure that we have the latest update, the latest Windows update. So make sure here you click on check for updates. Then you go here in advanced options and then in optional updates. And here you have to click on driver updates and install. Uh, you check this uh, Lenovo system. Click on download and install. Right click on download and install and install the latest drivers because if you don't have the latest driver your the game won't work i'm telling you 100 percent won't work so there's a this is the huge uh, chance it's gonna work if you make sure you have the latest driver also here make sure you press on your keyboard windows plus logo plus s you can also obviously click on the search button but i don't have it i deactivate it so okay i can use the shortcut windows logo plus s and here in the search bar write cmd command prompt run as administrator and here in the you have to enter this command this will scan uh, your computer and fix any problems so beginning system scan this process will take some time work for the verification process to complete once the verification has been completed what you have to do now to move to the next step so now in the next step we have to head over to graphic settings and here we have to go to the game so make sure you go to the game and you click on the game you click options and make sure here windows will force to use your gpu and it's always the GPU is highest in high performance, and it's in power saving. And here you also have to go to power saving, edit power saving, change power settings, and in power processor power management. And here it has to be maximum processor state uh, has to be on 100%, 100%, 100%, 100 okay. And that's pretty much it, all right? That's very important, all right? So also make sure you click on the game, you right click on the game, you click on properties, compatibility, and make sure you write a game in a compatibility mode and you also run the game, uh, disable full screen optimization, and you, dis you run the game as administrator. Click on now, apply, and run. That's what you have to do. Now, if, uh, now make sure now you follow the next step. Here, what we have to do is also Windows uh, logo plus I. And here we have to head over to storage. And here in storage, make sure you clean your temporary files. Maybe you have here a huge amount of temporary files. And uh, this, by removing your, you know, your temporary files will really lead to less crashing. Because also crashing can relate with uh, your memory reaching 100%. So if you go task manager, maybe you're in a game and memory is reaching your maximum capacity, the maximum, uh, um, you know, memory. So maybe that's the reason. Also, make sure you close your browser. As you can see, the browser Brave is consuming a lot of memory right now. So in this case, what you can do is just close the apps that are running in the background and just make sure you wow yeah just i think it's just impressive how much ram is consuming 
So make sure you go to details, you click on the game and you set to high priority so the game will the game will have uh, priority over any other apps that are running in, uh, on, on your computer in the background, you know. So make sure you're doing that. And here, we leave that on. Make sure you click on remove files. Click on continue now. And that's pretty much it. Now, the next method is make sure you go to go to personalize right click go to personalize and here in act colors make sure you disable transparency effect this usually will consume a lot of uh, memory all right now guys the next step what we have to do is if you have a geforce experience if you have a nvidia graphic card uh, make sure you install geforce experience from here click on the doll and this automatically uh, will um, you know give you the best updates drivers to install you can check for updates here and then install the latest update now you can also some people have some problems with geforce experience in-game overlay and when uh, it, this overlay will you know interact somehow it just crashes the game so make sure you turn this overlay game off all right and also on discord you can do that as well and now click on this download button we have to install we have to install microsoft visual c++ make sure you click on this button here and we have to click on the install now I already have on my computer also go to click on here to click here to download manually click on save you have to install directx user this is for um, to run any game okay you need this in order to run any game pretty much you see here for some games you need this so make sure you download and install now click on here click on yes click on agree and disable this click on next I already have it on my computer now if you have uh, Intel drive support uh, if you have a uh, Intel just click on download and for Nvidia I already set for AMD I'll leave the link in the description of this video I forgot to tell you about so yeah just so you know I have the links in the description of this video also this command I have in the description of this video now the next uh, the next step is what you have to do is to simply make sure you go to troubleshoot settings and here if you have any problems with the game sometimes for some people they just run the troubleshooter for a network and for power I don't know I just uh, I have I have tried this but didn't work for me maybe it will work for you as well. maybe it will work for you and in accessibility in visual effects you should have this also turn off in uh, also game I think it is turn on game mode you can leave this on if it's off but if you are in Windows 10 make sure you turn this off and captures here no game mode yes game this you can turn this off and um, in uh where is it in apps also make sure you close the apps that you don't need they're running in the background so make sure you delete some of the apps <coughs> this is important and you can also go to ms config right here system configuration go to boot go to advanced options and make sure here you enable number of processors so window will use your number of processors and select here the highest you have I have 12 I'll select 12 okay apply and okay now restart your computer and I hope guys now you can enjoy the game without any frustration thank you so much for watching this video and I hope you're gonna have a fantastic day take care